Also passed a bill requiring businesses that mandate vaccines to offer several alternatives to employees. That includes an option to show they have antibodies in their system, submit to periodic testing, or get a religious or medical exemption. The bill does not apply to employees who fall under President Biden's executive order, including hospitals and nursing homes, federal workers, and businesses with more than 100 workers. Senators debated the bill at length before passing it 33 to 14. Senator Kristen Rowers says as a conservative, she doesn't like putting mandates on businesses, but as a health care worker, she sees the benefit of the vaccine. Working as a charge nurse, working with COVID patients, I've seen the benefit of this vaccine. I can walk into a room and tell you if they're vaccinated without even looking at their medical record. And the reason is I can walk in and say, you're 90 and you need two liters of oxygen, I bet you're vaccinated. I walk in and you're 44 like I am, and you're air hungry and starving for oxygen, you're not vaccinated. The bill passed the House last night, 80 to 11. It'll head to the governor next.